What did you dream? I've had nothing but nightmares lately. Pretty horrible. Likewise, for the most part. In one, a monster grown from a stillborn child chased you. Ugh, that was horrible. I had a few nice dreams. For example, in one we sat round a fire, drinking good wine, and all around people danced and laughed. I like that one a lot better. Me too. But these dreams, and the others, ended in some tower. No matter what I dream, in the end, I would enter a tower. Recognize it? Know where it might be? I'm not sure. I don't think so. But there was something familiar about it. And something terrifying. The tower was stark and dead. But at the same time, I felt I had to enter it. Did you? No. Dreams all ended with me searching for the entrance. And the last time, instead of the tower, I saw your grizzled face. If not for the scar over your eye, I'd have thought I was still dreaming. I was afraid you were dead. Found some dwarves here. Said they'd try to wake you, but you were cold as ice and you weren't breathing. And yet you came in. Who listens to dwarves these days? Speaking of which, they're probably getting antsy. We should go. Got a boat on the beach. Once we land, we'll head for Kaer Morin. On horseback. Right. Conventional means of travel. They're just better. Though a portal would be quicker. And draw Aridin to us immediately. Rather not risk it. Besides, I hate portals. Damn! Listen, we gotta think of a way to... Welcome back, child. Siri! My, you've grown beautiful. Oh. 
No point standing around. Come on, time to greet the others. You've not changed a bit. Any of you. All just like I remembered. What? Little sis. All here, everyone you asked for help. Avalox resting in the tower, still in pretty bad shape. No reason to do it out here. Come inside. Time short. Wild Hunt will be here soon. Glad to see you, Triss. Thank Yennefer. She's the one who invited me. There'll be time to talk later. We should confer now. Yen, you know the Wild Hunt better than anyone else. Tell us about the magic they use. Their navigators open portals, rifts that we might counter with Dimeritium by our own magic. They also summon the frost that occupies the voids through which they travel. There's just not enough of us. Everything else. Good to see you. Ha! You found her. They told me the hunt was out there. I hope this gas She's one of us, Geralt. No way we'll let him take her. Damn piece of junk. They're only younger than Vesin. Let's go. Greetings, Wolf. to see you. Huh. Set out alone, Vess tracked me down. Insisted on coming. I ought to give you a hiding for not asking my help. But I took it all out in Roach along the way. Ah, some old friends. What's this horse son doing here? We need him. You might have forgotten what he did. I haven't. Gotta save Ciri, whatever the cost, and Letho's faced the hunt before. I don't question his abilities. I simply don't trust him. Letho won't betray us. <laughs> You're naive. Always have been. Usually I don't give a shit, but this time it could kill Vess and me both. Think this through before it's too late. We'll stay and help. But we don't want him at our backs. Get everybody together. Time to talk. Thank you for coming. The Wild Hunt will be here soon. They're coming for Ciri. Want to take her? We'll stop them. How do you even know the Hunt will show? They always know where I teleport to. And they move from place to place in an instant. So what's our plan? There aren't many of us, but I'd trust any of you with my life. Work together and we'll defeat the Hunt. 
When they attack, Yen will dome the fortress with a magic shield, and will be forced to land outside the walls. If they're dispersed out in the woods, we could hunt down small groups of riders. Got our first volunteer for the hunting party. I'm the second. Count me in, too. Always believed attack is the best defense. The hunt will try to penetrate into the fortress through navigator portals. I can do nothing against this kind of magic, so you'll need to find and close as many as you can while hunting in the woods. Lambert will make us die meridian bombs. Remember the formula? Of course. Excellent. Erden should work on the portals as well. I shall also give you each an amulet. Snap them in half and you'll become invisible, at least while you remain still or move slowly. Move abruptly, engage any foes, clash with them, and they will see you. Apart from that, they will be able to hear you and smell you. If you come across a large unit, do not attack. Signal Triss and she will provide support. I'll look for your signal. As soon as I see it, I'll rain fire on the forest. Ciri's most important in all of this. The hunt's after her, and we have to defend her at all costs. What do I do? Stay inside the keep. If they break through, come inside. We'll all converge to help you. Out of the question! I can look after myself. No one doubts that, child. But remember the most important moment when hunting a monster? Wait for an opportunity. After the council, I'll give you an amulet. If you use it, a ball of fire will land where you're standing, just in case. What else do we have that we can use? Since you plan to ambush the hunt in the woods, I could dig some trapping pits, blue stripe style. Meaning? Deep as the dark abyss, bottoms bristling with sharpened stakes. I brought this Mahakaman mix. Flammable as bone dry saltpeter and plowing sticks to everything. We fill some barrels, stack them in a narrow passage, and fire them up at an opportune moment. You know we stand on a vast deposit of gas. If need be, I could open cracks in the earth create explosions. I would need to prepare, though. There's a laboratory and the workshop. One thing to remember, we've got limited resources and even less time. We ought to decide what kind of weaponry will be most useful against the hunt. Absolutely. We need to assign one type of weaponry each to the lab and workshop. Who needs access to the lab? I started brewing some potions. I'd like to finish, if you don't mind. I could prepare more of those witcher's traps, but I'd need all the lab equipment. There aren't many of us, so we'll need to prepare as many traps as possible. Let's talk about the workshop. Been wanting to fix that breach in the wall, but we'll need the same tools to clear the rubble from the armory. Rubble? Haven't you heard? Roof caved in a couple of years back. There's some excellent swords in there. Swords we could use. Filling in the breach seems just as important. They come through there, the siege will be over awfully quick. Fixing the breach in the wall's a priority. We won't have time to do much else. Everything settled? Yes, settled. We don't have much time, so let's get to work. Let's sum up. Yennefer will create a magic barrier to repel the main assault. That should push the opposing force into the woods, where Lambert, Geralt, and Letho will be waiting. They'll use Dimeridium to close the navigator's portals, stop as many warriors as possible from entering the fortress. Triss will be waiting for their signal, then give the riders hell. All others will repel any foes who make it inside the fortress walls. If anything goes wrong, we abandon the outer courtyard, pull back to the keep. Remember, Aridan can't get his hands on Ciri. That's most important. Let's look at the map of the fortress, figure out the details. feeling we've overlooked something important. Don't think about it. What's ready? Haven't had much time to prepare, so not much, honestly. 
I'm exposing you all to danger, unnecessarily. You worry too much. Wipe that frown off your face, we'll make it. Thanks. For everything. I'll saddle the horses. Come once you're ready to head into the woods. Taking Letho with us. You know my opinion. <laughs>